Howdy friends, Mangaka here. Going to be commentating some Rev 2 action for us. Our winner's final. Going to be between Havoc Noah on the usual Eno and of course JR121 who we just saw play in the Melty Blood Top 3 on Soul Bad Guy. Going to be a dope time. Let's get into it. I got to reset the scores real quick. And I cleared everything. I have, I have made the goof. Our... There we go. Everything set up for ourselves, my friends. Hope you all have a fantastic evening here. We're wrapping up the Akihabara Arcade Sunday by Weekly. And that these VODs in particular are going to be uploaded to YouTube from a uh, recorded file. I did a little switcheroo. We got a slightly better graphics card in the computer tonight, so I'm able to stream to Twitch and record at the same time to give us some higher VOD quality on the YouTube. I have Noah clearing round one very quickly. For those of us that were with us earlier today, we would have seen um we would have seen Havoc Noah tear through the loser side of the bracket. In Guilty Gear Strive to miss it. Like a no, you have not. We are doing Rev 2 top three because that will be far quicker than Dragon Ball top three. Oh here we go, Ground Viper. Take him through. Oh my gosh, you can special cancel that normal, that's correct. Gunflame's gonna get jumped over, it's an overhead, JR does not block. Havoc Noah now, styling out with these Eno combos, not getting the kill. Blitz on wake up, got counter blitz in return. We got the reactions, we got the reflexes. Havoc Noah takes game one. Our top three of the bracket for Guilty Gear Rev 2 is in... Winner's final right now between Noah and JR, and waiting down in loser's final, it's, uh, I believe, Kaisogen? Kaisogen. Managed to defeat Wobblub. Or did Wobblub DQ? Yeah, we're trying to see if we can sort of just get away with it like this. Talking to the Twitch chat. Like it says, I've seen everything, a bit of everything today. I like the format. Sort of the idea. I want to be able to try and get all the, like, as much VOD so people from any game can review. Noah was supportive of getting, uh, cutting some of Strive's time on stream to let Skull Girls, the first game, go through. Burst from Havoc Noah on the ground Viper. The note gets intercepted in air, but a jump in from JR. Short combo there. Probably could have made more with it. HCL. Just re jump into the delayed overhead. It is going to catch. Noah cooking in all cylinders. 2D, Gunflame, doesn't get the 5k connect. And we're not really getting any sort of knockdowns. You're seeing that they're able to air tech in this version of Guilty Gear. Good blocks though. Follows defense, another stroke the big tree. It's gonna be a big hit. We get a wall stick. And now Noah combos off of it. Full combo, Okazemi, but I just simple Volcanic Viper. Gunflame, YRC, the empty low. Pick him up. JR running the offense, wild throw. Oh, but he misses up the combo, and Noah's there with a throw in return. Burst from JR, wants to keep some momentum. I don't think he wanted Fafnir. I think he was going for a heavy uh, Volcanic Viper. Havoc Noah, though, full bar meter. Goes for it. Gets the insta-kill. I'm not zooming out on the camera. Absolutely spectacular finish there from Havoc Noah, who's going to... The next game queued up. Off stream right now, we should be having our loser semi-final match between Piccolo and Chetman in Dragon Ball Fighters. Ninja did defeat Chetman in the loser's quarter, but he's DQ'd after that to go get some food, speak of the devil. Love you. Thank you for being here. Good shit today. Mm, I had to do some. Yeah, I'll see you around. They trade the 6P of Eno catching. Gonna be a full punish here as well on the Volcanic Viper. Drop looking like a reset as JR comes out swinging. The just blocks and the reversal super as well, catching the Gunflame gap. 
Havoc Noah just contesting every single correct way possible. Good defense. Does not block the fourth overhead, which, you know what, neither did I. Havoc Noah looking to round out this set with a perfect. JR, though, going to burst. HCL double to the YRC, or at least I think it was the red RC for full combo set. And like I say it, perfecto. Noah cleans that one up, sends JR down to the loser side of the bracket, where now JR will have to fight Kaisajin. Swapping out the players right now as we move right into the losers final. Life's looking pretty good here. I'm just going to do a quick bit of research. Pull up some, some, some. Right, I'm going to go with this layout, I think, for Kaisa Gen to get their pronouns down. And here we go. It's now Sin versus Soul Bad Guy. Sin, of course, a top tier as heck character in this version of the game, unlike his Strive self, where people kind of have him middle of the pack, if not lower. The only boy that didn't get anything new with the whole patch. And there are some just wild shenanigans happening right now. We saw a burst to get rid of a dust. The air DP will be punished. Kaisajin closing the gap. They're looking for some pressure. Good block on the overhead. Immediate jump in. Going to punish the food. He... Counter hit. Big driver. Blocks the overhead. Kaisajin gets the knockdown, but now she's under pressure. Here comes JR. Pick up DP, gets him off. Kaisajin now, she's running the pressure. Reversal 2D. Nice, short, and simple. The tick throw as well, wild throw style. Has the combo to pick it up, but Kaisajin choosing to spend the burst right now. Goes for a ride, the lightning. PRCs to punish the riot stamp. And JR burst as well. I think they burst twice already in this round alone. Oh, you can tell. <laughs> This is some Rev 2, friends. This is some Rev 2. Comes in on the gun flame. Does not finish the combo. Beak driver. If you're a little unfamiliar with Sin in this version of Guilty Gear, every time Sin uses any special move, he consumes some of that stamina bar. It's not just when he does a follow-up. It's any special move. So, And eating in this game restores that stamina bar. So eating is very important. You'll see high-level Sin's Prioritize going for knockdowns into getting their food read and then following up with their Okazemi from there and Kaisajin getting a hit. Takes a bite of that grub. Closes the gap, the air trade. Kaisajin having the point. Catches JR's jump and is going to tie up the grounds here. Mano y mano, 101. Uno y uno. We're going to follow those through there.
Had to do one bit of TOing things. Kaisajin goes up game one. Looking good so far. Let's rock. Betray, tech back in. Jumps away from the gun flame. Bandit Bringer's gonna whiff. Kaisajin now looking to intercept the riot stam. JR will burst this. 6P does not quite get a combo from it, however. The low profile bursts that as well. They trade. Kaisajin, though, getting some Oki. Catches him with the low, it looks like. Elk Hunt. No, Beak Driver, excuse me. Yo, Kaisajin, though, so far controlling this space masterfully. Had the PRC, didn't have like a DP to anti air. But it get, they get the air throw? That was so sick. And she is cooking on all cylinders right now, Kaisajin, with this sin. She is looking to have her own turn at Havoc Noah. Multiple overheads, gonna catch JR one to one, goes for a reset, burst, get off of me, JR says. Just block 2D to counter hit. JR now, some Gunflame Oki, the DP to interrupt the Fafnir. Here we go, Fafnir. They get the knockdown, huge damage from JR off that corner combo. He's going in now, gets a Fafnir hit, Kaisajin. They're not out of this one yet, but they just might be off of that hit. Rounds tied up again. Losers final. Completely brutal here. DP gonna check. Both sides trying to find their next successful blow, and it's JR that gets it initially. the pressure now beak driver follow up look at that imagine if we had that for strives and looks good don't it huh trying to just apply as much chip damage as we can right stamp the zama coming through Counter hit, JR able to pick it up. It is 1-1 between our competitors. Loses final at the Akihabara Arcade Anime Sunday Bi-Weekly. Minor to everybody we're hanging out as well that next Saturday will be our monthly at Akihabara Arcade, starting at the usual early afternoon time. Counter hit, JR is super low on HP now. Gets intercepted, Kaisajin, they drop the combo! This could be terrible. Big Driver will catch that. There it goes down in this round. Keep it on rocking. Hello there, Select Screen. No, we are in Westminster, Colorado. Buttons on Wake Up would be the Colorado Springs branch of the FGC out here. Volcanic Viper completely misses. Kaisajin. 2 1, Kaisajin. So far, you got one more game to win, Kaiso. Even players, such a heated game between them that they can't remember what the score is. So here we go, Kaisajin. On this sin, looking to close it out against JR one to one and earn their turn at fighting Havoc Noah. Absolutely, select screen. 
Here we go, take him through. Burstal, Burstal. I'm trying to... Where would... I gotta see if they have... It's been a while since I've heard from the Springs community, so... Like I tell you, I, like I know they're alive. Let me find their Discord server. Copy this link. Coming here, waste select screen from my own Twitch chat. Twitch channel. There'll be a link for you. That uh, Discord link is the Springs Discord for the Colorado FGC. Oh, shoot! They are getting the knockdown, though. He is up around here in this pivotal game three. Game four, excuse me. Counting is difficult this late at night. The air throw from Kaisajin, though. They're looking to close this gap. The full charge does connect! JR not burning that burst just yet. No knockdown achieved, so it's a reset to neutral. We're going to take a bite of our meat on a stick. Oh, but Bammer Bringer counter hit. This is big damage for JR. Gets the red of Roman cancel. Full conversion. Ride the lightning reversal. One block, two block. And it's a cross up that hits. JR isn't ready. Gets caught on the hit. All of a sudden now, Kaisajin was able to force this to last round once again. It's their fourth in a row, if I remember correctly. Wake up DP, JR not scouting it. Goal burst though, this is huge. He's got 100 bar. That means you get four Roman cancels in Rev 2 here. Yellow Roman cancels in particular. Red. Oh, he tried to blitz Black, I thought, and it gets counter hit. Now JR taking a lot of damage. Kaisa Jin completely in control. Get some food back. YRCs to go for something. Trying to keep up the pressure, no doubt. YRC, miss, counter hit, burst back. Riot stamp. He's going to jail him to the ground. Big jump and counter hit. The jump air throw catching the safe jump of JR. Blitz going to barely whiff. They, oh, my Lord. It is nothing but wild out here, just like you'd expect from Soul and his protege, the son of his rival. By the lightning, does this catch the jump? No. Completely whiffs. He's able to get the jump in. JR takes this up to game five. This is lit. This is lit. Kaisa Jen and JR 1 2 1. Game five. This decides it all, my friends. Yeah, actually, Judson, you're right. Oh, and it's Mortal Danger in game five, and JR with the DP follow up. Gets the initial hit. They're just trading sides now. Mortal counter, big damage again. Six pieces is gonna completely catch Kaisajin on their wake up. JR now some dust loops. Tyrant rave. Guys to go for a gunflame thing, but Kaisajin techs out, mashes her way through. Beautiful six P on the right stamp. Not letting JR get those cheeky hits in. Misses the combo though on the overdrive. Blitz, catches JR jumping in, trying to get an advantageous position. This is a huge combo, and it will result in a defeat, actually. Kaiser Jin is now at match point. She needs one more round to close us out, but will JR force the issue? Air evading. Good air to air so far. And there's that burst, not being called out. But the gun flame is. Take him down. Burst. Oh, but they're out of food! Kaisajin will eat a Gunflame hit! And now this is pretty hard for Sin because without that stamina bar, has to prioritize getting it and eats a 2D for it, but the wake-up DP immediately using their food resource. They just wake up and do it! Oh my lord! But JR should get tons of damage until the throw! Momentum swinging one way and then another way. Blitz gets blown up. I think JR did a high blitz. Air conversion, gonna drop, Beak Driver just for the Oki. They are being pushed back, but the Elkon runs into the overhead, and that is it, Kaisajin sends JR home with third place here.
and will advance on to take on Havoc Noah's Eno. Which, if y'all were tuning in to Tampa Never Sleeps, you would have seen Havoc Noah. Oh my lord, my hair is. All right, that's better. That's better. You would have seen Havoc Noah fighting it out in the top eight recently since the rollback update got pushed to Rev 2. And you would have seen him actually play Sin. And Noah had um, a breakdown of the matchup being even, but he simply is nerfed online. Here we go. We are up to grand finals now. Havoc Noah taking the stage. Looking to win his second bracket of the evening. He took down everybody in his way. Going up to grand finals after he got sent down to losers in a Clutch as hell set from Pip Game and playing the Dr. Faustin Strive. Fist bump traded between the two, and here we go. Kaisergen has a lot to prove against the major level threat that is Havoc Noah, and this is a button check. Certainly a button check. I refuse to believe. Or are they goofing? I'm like, no, they're they're into this. This is real. What do you mean? I am seeing Havoc Noah play Johnny. The throw though, Kaiser Jen getting the Leo pressure. Mid catch is stun, however. Gets the cross up in the corner, full counter hit. Havoc Noah finally gets a reversal super. Should seal around against Kaisajin's Leo. Say my name. It starts with the letter J. As I go, hey. Cross up, just block. Here we go, Kaisajin. Just looking to blitz us out with Leo. Gets the flash kick DP down. The blitz actually catching the cross up. That's disgust. Take him through, 5k. Here comes the pressure now. We are currently at level two, Miss Finer. Spend it there, though. Flash kick, Noah just says, enough. I burst this. Good just block, but Kaiser Jin just forcing the issue again. Havoc Noah not able to interrupt. He's got full bar, however. Miss Finer dashing. The coin serving as a meaty. Another one. We got level three Mistfinder. Goes for the low. Kaisajin blocks. Oh, again! With counter. Do it again. Leo certainly a far cry from his top tier days of Strive here. Strong character, I believe, but is not as like belligerent as he appears in the latest title of the game. Here we go, take him through, knock down. Full combo as well. Wake up blitz, the parry from Kaisajin will intercept Havoc Noah. No full combo, simple knockdown is what I would say. This Y-hander not doing the job. Miss finer pressure though. But finally Kaisajin busts out with the fireball. The throw, however, level three Miss finer. Blitz, blitz. Pretty, pretty scary situation for Noah, but able to work his way through. 6K will result in a launch. Throws the cross-up attempt. We're going to see some combos, is what I would say. First, Kaiser Jin doing this to keep themselves alive a little longer. Noah, though, just poking with his misfinder. It's only level one. Oh, my lord. Gold. Are seeing the clash goes for the simplest of punishes, the throw. And Havoc Noah and his Johnny take game one. Kaisajin will once again lock in Leo. As I have no idea what context any of this holds. Here we go. Pressure time, come on, grab your friends. Leo with the DP. Reversal, though, say my name. We get the knockdown here. Goes run overhead, but 
Kaisen just responding, if you can do that, I, so can I. In terms of reversals. And we're just seeing just like the most, <laughs> the simplest of Mist Finers. 6K counter hit. Drops the combo. Good anti-air from Havoc Noah. Closes out that round. We're gonna keep on rocking. Counter hit. Havoc Noah closing the distance. Full pressure. A coin for your troubles, my good third king. If you're a king, I'm a king of the pirates, Johnny says. But yes, I like One Piece. Bates the DP this time. Bates the burst as well. Just Now, if only the combo could match. <laughs> but I mean, I have no idea where on the... on the playability ranking that having no... Oh my, oh my, oh, it's just back to you, back to me, back to you. Blitz, blitz is for everybody. The empty low will catch. Having no burst says, get off of me, please. Miss Finer. Oh my lord, the side swap. Completely miss. Oh, I don't think that was a correct. I don't think that was the intentional input, Kaiser Gingers. Having that straw, oh my lord, reaction. Having Noah up 2 0 with his, with his Johnny. <laughs> Let me tell you, friends, when I woke up today, I did not tell myself, yeah, today I'm going to commentate some Havoc Noah Johnny. Johnny, of course, easily the most difficult character to play in this game, but certainly the most rewarding. Because once you have mastered the character, you will now play the number one character in the game. Have I know it gets taken down to the ground? Reversal super again. But the counter! Kaisajin had the reach! He's going on a tear! But the full charge just! Are you kidding? But no, no, no bumbles. No bumbles. A throw for the trouble. Havoc Noah now looking to close out the tournament set here. To end my suffering, as it were. 6K, air throw. Takes him down, misses the Okazemi. Has a read on the block, but still plus on block, it seems. Good defense so far. The mash will get counter hit. And Kaisergen on a tear so far, looks at the reversal super, does the parry once more, will catch Noah pressing. And there it is. Noah delaying. Bates the DP, Red Roman cancel to keep him safe. Kaisergen now, she gets the next hit, is able to get around on the board for herself. And now they're looking to try and force themselves to at least take this to game four. Miss Finer's owning, Havoc Noah just content to deny Leo any sort of gameplay here. Level three, Miss Finer. I'm pretty sure Kaisajin was, they, they were trying to get a DP out there when we saw the whiff too heavy. Oh, it looked like Noah was baiting, just didn't block. Comes pressure. And there you go, one of the reasons. One of the reasons Leo is a little weaker in this game, that pressure, you can just sort of instant block and throw him out of it. It's gonna be the burst from Havoc Noah. Burst spin on both sides, only two coins left for this Johnny, they trade. Level three, this is the last miss finder that can be buffed and Havoc Noah's out of resources. Kaiser Jen throws it on the DP. Oh, tries to go for the unblockable setup, it's following, it's following, Havoc Noah. Oh, danger time again. My lord, this is so stressful. Fly Hander, it's a mortal counter hit. Kaisajin now with the combo. Havoc Noah missing some tags, gets this Y Hander, closes it out. And takes Guilty Gear Rev 2 tonight. Playing Johnny. Y'all, I don't know how to feel about that. I don't know how to feel about that. I, I feel like it functioned, but I don't think it was pretty, is, is what I will say about that, but either way. GG's Havoc Noah winning both Guilty Gears this evening at the Akihabara Arcade Anime Sunday. We will now be getting our top three 
of Dragon Ball Fighters going down for y'all here in just a moment. Don't go anywhere, my friends. We'll be right back with Dragon Ball.